Anyway, before we get into that debate, which I do want to get into, I do want to get the village update out of the way. So right. let's do this quickly because it's not that much. Now we got a whole lot of help on the mountain this week, and I don't know if you guys can see it. It's really dark, so I'm I'm sorry that it's it's nighttime, but you know, it doesn't really stop us from recording this video. Uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see it. Maybe turn up the gamma a bit, but it's actually quite lower. Um, I must say. Yeah, there's a nice groove out of it uh, on the south side that makes it really feel like we're getting to the bottom of it. Yeah, so thank you everyone for helping out uh, this week on bringing down this mountain. Uh, I can finally look at it and say uh, we're, we're getting there. We're definitely more than halfway. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like I'm thinking like a couple more weeks. Yeah, that should be really fun. The next difference would be these planned walls, these planned houses here. They kind of look like a mess right now, but it's the start of our castle walls. The walls mm -hmm. that are going to be surrounding the castle. Uh, so yeah. Like I'm feeling like we're, we're because the mountain's coming so close to being done, we want to just be prepared for when that happens so that we have some buildings down that we can start working on uh, and just planning the area. That's right. So other than that, the village area seems to be growing, you know, very nicely, especially on this side. And if we go down to the port area, not much mm -hmm. has changed. Uh, we know that you guys can see this Corbita here that Chunk Lord has decided he's going to make a Corbita. And you know what? He can do it. I know you can do it, Chunk. <laughs> yep. I know you can do it. Uh, anyway, the other than that, not much has changed. We are had to change our plans for the port area a little bit due to unforeseen circumstances. Uh, we did not realize that the length of a house can't be more than 20. Yeah, it turns out 20 that tiles. while... While video recording <laughs> that that last episode, uh, I planned we... a twenty nine long house. <laughs> mm -hmm, Apparently, right. that was a bug. Apparently, you can't do that. Yeah, it's odd. So I didn't know that, uh, but now now we know. So now we had to change the plans. So there is one quite... other major change in the port area. I think that you've been working on. Just share that with everybody. Okay. Now, <laughs> if you see over here. Our, our change basically means, um, how would you describe it? It's going to be a big change to what we were planning. Like we were pretty much done with the terraforming, I think. But now mm -hmm. that we can only build twenty uh, a house 20 long, we decided, hey, let's go all out, uh, deed all, or use the land that we've already deeded. So mm -hmm. if you guys can see where I'm going here. Basically, the perimeter of our place is going all the way around. We're gonna have like a, we're gonna have this entrance that leads into our big like port area with houses all around. It's hard to explain, but I can sort of try to explain. It's like the sure. land is going to uh, wrap around an area of water. Uh, boats will come into that area of water, and we are gonna place. I mean, what you see is just like a skeletal. We're yeah. going to fill in a lot of the land and build buildings on it so that boats can pull up to those buildings. Um, you're going to have entranceways from the side for small boats. The big boats can come in from the front. And it'll just be sort of like this small little port slash water village area. <laughs> yeah. Uh, in the end, it's going to look quite nice. I can't <laughs> wait tall walls around the outside of it and it looked like a big kingdom port area uh the ones that you would see in like uh like dungeons Movies. and dragons or something yeah, sure. uh, so now that we got that out of the way rare where are you uh because yeah. because we don't actually have a blacksmithing